Welcome to another new video from Expo Hub. Myself Rakesh, I work in one of the top IT company. Uh, currently I'm assigned with multiple UiPath projects. So here I'm sharing another learning uh, that could help you. Uh, many times we have to work on Word documents, right? And um, that requires, for example, you open a Word document and you want to replace the um, employee uh, who is assigned for certain work in a document right kind of a SOP documents so how do you do that so basically we will be learning how to um, you know open that word document and then you know making changes to a given word document things like that uh, so that is that is our topic for the day so there are two things we will do um, we will learn how to first of all there has to be a word package in UiPath right otherwise the activities for Word document will not come right so you learn how to get that Word package second you know we'll work on activities of Word so there are a couple of activities that we're going to learn so very simple uh, why uh, after you install your UiPath you may not have the package okay so yeah in case you are typing the activity something for Word and you're not finding them right um, so generally if I type word here uh, see I can see uh, the entire activities for word but in case you have not installed you will not find all these activities so how do you get them okay very simple uh, very generic video but again this will help a person who is trying you know he's struggling to get something done with word document right so let's quickly go to home and here you have tools right so this is where it show you uh, different packages which are currently available but however i want to install a package so in your design tab you have something called manage packages okay i'll click on manage packages and here i'm going to type word okay so one you will find uipath word activities by uipath so this is the best one you can select this and then click on install and save okay so once you save it all the dependent dependencies will get installed so i have already done it but again this is where you have to come and install our entire package for the word document so once you do that if you type word on your activities panel you will see all these activities are listed out here right add picture app and text export to pdf uh, word document to pdf right read text replace picture replace text and so many things so we'll simply use one of the activity okay no, not necessary that we all have to cover an entire thing but again for to just to understand we'll just use one of the activity let's say replace text okay so now uh, the replace text how how that's supposed to work now if you see uh, what to replace and uh, you know um, and what is that search word let's say i want to search for the name whatever the name and i want to replace with with something the problem here is uh, it doesn't specify which location I should go right so what I will do I'll go back to activity and then here you have something called word application scope okay word application scope uh, now within that I will place this replace text okay done now here uh, it's asking word application scope so I'm going to click here and tell which is that file so i'll show you that file so this is the file okay so what i'm going to do i have simply made a word document and i have typed my name is rakesh uh, he is trying to uh, or i am trying to replace the text now that is funny um, but just to understand right i am trying to replace the text okay <laughs> so this is a simple example so i'll just save it okay so the file name is rakesh test I'm going to close this um, so now what I will do in the word application scope I am going to select this and uh, go to documents and here I have got Rakesh test click on open so now it knows where to go and replace the text so I want to replace Rakesh with let's say somebody else's name somebody else is assigned to the word let's say let's say give me a name let's say Deepak Kumar okay He's supposed to work on that let's say so if you have to replace all i have to do now is i'll save it and then i'll ensure uh, you know the file is closed right the file is closed nothing is open so i'll simply run the bot okay run it let's see what is happening so execution started 
and execution completed so if you go to output panel you can see that right so all i will do now is go back right go back to your documents and then this is the file i'm trying to open wow you can see my name was there that has been replaced with a different name so this is a very generic example but again i am sure this would help you in a couple of business cases that you might be dealing with all right guys so please subscribe to my channel if the videos are helping you please do subscribe please do like and share my channel thank you have a wonderful day guys